What's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. This is a free general collective reading. Caps through Sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. I got a channel in, so I decided to do this reading. I hope everybody is doing well on this lovely January 9th, 2022. Huge shout out to my oldest child. She is 16 today. Happy birthday, my Capricorn. Just saying. Okay. So um, if you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. All donations are greatly appreciated. Single mama, two kids. So um, I truly appreciate all the donations. Okay. So um, the channel message I received was, um, uh, oh, um, a Pisces is about to lash out at a Sagittarius soon. It's going to be the wrong choice for sure. Um, that's what I heard. A Pisces is about to lash out at a Sagittarius soon. Lash out. Lash out. So, um, lash out. Lash out would mean like, I think, severe verbal um, vomit. Severe verbal. Blah. Um probably very loud very angry hopefully it's not domestic violence type like with physical blows hopefully not um whatever lash out is in this pisces life um everybody's different everybody's on different time and life paths um only you, you know you know your story if you resonate with this you could be the pisces you could be the side you could be somebody connected to these people um so however lash out is in their life for a lot of these i feel it's severe verbal for some it could possibly might go to blows i'm not sure um dear lord of mine. um so you plug it in how it resonates um we have karma on the bottom of the deck so i think this is negative karma this this sagittarius is about to transmute the energy in a huge way and reveal important information on a theft about of this pisces this Pisces is going to wish they never stole or lashed out at this Sagittarius. Oh my God. Whoa. So you plug it in how it resonates. Oh God. Okay. Well, we're getting deep in here. So whoever this Pisces is, they have stole from person, people, place, family, situation, or organization. For some of these Pisces, they could have stole from you, Sag, if this resonates for you or someone you know or you're connected to. However, that resonates, but um, they're going to—they're taking out their anger on you about something. It could be about the theft, or it could be about something else. Um, however, that resonates and plugs in your life. But heard you're going to transmute the energy, so good for you. Transmuting of energy is always positive. Just saying. So you're going to transmute the energy, meaning you're going to turn the energy around for you in a positive way. Um, I heard you, and the way you're going to do it, apparently, from the spiritual message, is you're going to reveal, sounds like to a very important person or people, probably authorities, uh, maybe local police, state police, uh, or federal authorities, however that resonates, about uh, a very serious theft of a Pi of the Pisces. The Pisces, I'm feeling the Pisces that lashed out at you. Um, and it's not going to go well for, for her. For some, it's a masculine. Oh, okay. I heard for some, it's not going to go well for them. Uh, for some, it's a femme Pisces. For some, it's a masculine Pisces. So you have to plug these people in how it resonates. So for some of you guys, it's a femme Pisces lashing out at you that stole from person, people, place, situation, fam family, situation, organization, etc. For some, it's a masculine. But whoever these are, masculine or femme, you can be masculine or femme Pisces. It's not going to go well for them masculine or femme, um, because that it was, sounds like it's a huge theft. It doesn't sound like it's no baby theft. doesn't sound like they went around and, you know, took $20 out of their mom's purse. I mean, it, this is a huge theft. So negative karma for them and positive karma for you because um, you're about to transmute the energy. Now, for a lot of you guys, I feel whatever they're lashing out at you um, for, I don't feel it's the theft. I feel it might be something else. Um, but you have to plug it in how it resonates. That's just my in logic and intuition and reasoning on this. But you have to plug it in how it resonates um, in your own individual situation. But for some of you guys, it's a masculine Pisces about to lash out at you. For some, it's a femme. 
and you are Sag, masculine, and family. It's going to create several negative series of chain of events for this Pisces, several. Police and investigators. Oh my God, whoa. I heard it's going to create ne several negative series of chain of events for this Pisces, police and investigators. So definite negative karma for this Pisces, but... Um, it's going to be positive karma for you because you're going to transmute energy because you know about this theft. But sounds like this Pisces is taking something out on you, whether it's the theft or something else. They're just using you as a punching bag. So you're about to positively transmute the energy and get it out. I mean, you're just about to put it out there. You're about to wipe your hands of this and put it out there. And I don't blame you. Um, that's a that's a wonderful example of transmutation of energy. You go with your bad self, Sag, whoever this is. Um, but in all fairness, it sounds like this Pisces masculine or femme is using you as a punching bag. And they know they stole from person, people, place, family, situation, or organization. They refused to make it better. And they free willingly stole. They made the free willing mental choice to steal. Um, so they know. They know they did it. Um so, I mean, I don't, I just don't know what else to say about that. They shouldn't have done it to begin with. Or they should have turned the money in. But apparently they refuse to do that too. So, it looks like you're about to receive positive karma in this. They're about to receive negative. For some, you will get high honor for this. For some, not. Okay, I heard for some of you guys, you're going to get high honor for this. And for some, you're not. So for some, you're going to get high honor for transmutating this energy. And it sounds like you're going to go to our police and investigators. So I think for some, you're going to call local police, state police, or federal authorities, police and investigators. So investigators, I feel, could be feds or it could be governmental entity agency energy, however that plugs in. And then police, I think, is either local or state. Um, but for some some of you, Sages, you're going to get high, high honor for... Um, doing this for some you're not so um for those of you just recently joining the channel and you have no clue what i'm talking about with high honor high honor is basically being recognized uh, it's publicly recognized usually um for this it's the high honor card in the kipper you can see it so um good for you the sages that are going to get high honor for hard for some you are for some you're not so um you have to plug it in how it resonates okay let's see if i hear anything else um let me pull at least one for overall energy spirit um messages here for this Shape shifting on the bottom of the deck, so things are about to change in this situation. Sad, you're about you are about to be the game changer in this situation. But it sounds like the triggering of this and the starting of this is this Pisces lashing out at you. They're using you as a freaking punching bag or trying to use you as a punching bag, and you're about to transmute the energy and shape shift the energy. Um, good for you. Good for you. And like I said, some I heard from Spirit, you're gonna get high honor. So um High honor in the Kipper deck is that's an awesome card to be pulling. Just saying. Um, we got effortless reversed. Overall energy. Let me see if I hear anything. This Sagittarius knows this Pisces is very, very, very unapologetic, very unsympathetic, and very unempathetic about the huge theft. And they are right. Oh my goodness, you plug it in how it resonates. I heard this Sag knows that this Pisces is very unapologetic, unsympathetic, and unempathetic um, because um, of the huge theft. And I heard from Spirit, you're right, Sag. So this this message is for you, Sag. Um, I feel, I feel whoever you are, um, this hasn't happened yet with the lashing out at you with this Pisces, but it's, uh, for a lot of you guys, I feel it might happen soon. So that's why as soon as I got the download in, I came in here and I clicked the camera on because everybody's on different time of life paths. For some, I feel it might happen tonight. For some, tomorrow. For some, 
maybe in a couple of days. So I didn't want to wait on delivering the message is what I'm trying to say. Um, because it sounds like the precipitating factor in the factor in this is the Pisces is using you as a punch, punching bag or trying to. And you know they're very um, cold, unsympathetic, unempathetic. Um, they like to use people, person or people as punching bags, i.e. you. Um, and they are very heartless and cold, unsympathetic, unempathetic, uncaring, unkind. They stole a huge amount of money and they have no sympathy or empathy for that. Um, that's extreme narcissistic behavior, extreme. So effortless reversed in overall energy for here is basically, um, I think it was, um, I think this is um, the unsympathetic narcissistic type behavior of this Pisces. Um, I think they're hard to get along with. I think they like to pick fights. I think they like to use you as a punching bag. I think they like to obviously love to steal from person, people, place, family, situation, organization. They're very narcissistic effortless reversed they're not easy to get along with if it was upright they'd be easy to get along with they'd be very personable um etc 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 but they're not they're not easy to get along with they're very selfish they're very narcissistic um I, you know this you're highly intuitive whoever you are sad you know this you could have sad in your sun moon rising venus ortho midheimer jupiter the pisces could have pisces in their sun moon rising venus ortho midheimer jupiter heard it's at least two pisces in the universe one at least one masculine at least one feminine you can be masculine or femme so um and also effortless reverse could be the relationship dynamic between you and this pisces i don't feel it's very um i don't feel it's easy i don't feel it's an easy relationship dynamic i feel it's very strained um very volatile and obviously very loud um very loud um it's like a chihuahua ah barky chihuahua is what i picture this Pisces as, and I hate to say that, but I'm serious, like a barky chihuahua, masculine or femme. So I feel the relationship is very strained, very cold, um, but you're about to transmute the energy. So congrats to you. Congrats. And also effortless reverse could be the fact that they didn't even try to turn the money in, um, too, possibly. All right. Well, I'm getting out of here. Love you guys. Hope it helps. Namaste.